What's poppin', my people? You already know what this is. Today we got a story, a Rikers Island story about C-74 when I was in the adolescence. And this is for educational purposes at the same token, you feel me? But I'ma break down to you what we used to do with the razor blades, the gem stars, and how it opened up inside one of my boys' stomach. Max. Wow. Check this out, right? You see this? Brand new. Boom. A lot of dudes confront, you know, and no disrespect to nobody, but they be like in the videos, like, I'm going to show you how you use a gem star or how you they wrap it up, my dude. Doing, B. You could tell a dude, he ain't been doing that. You heard? He got to be like sensitive, scared. And this is not glorifying or nothing. This is just facts. Here we go. It is what it facts. is. You had you needed this in order to survive on the island. If you was about it and getting into it or if you was gang gang, everybody's looking for one of these. That's a fact. I'll never lie to you. So a lot of dudes will hit you up with this. And if when I was in my times on the island, you're going to wish you got shot. That's a uh, fact. Going overboard. <laughs> shot. <laughs> Look at that. I even flew <laughs> something. That's how you know it's really coming out from the mouth. You Yo, Hold on. Let me change it. I got more over pause. here. Hold on. Give me one second. Bam. <laughs> so, got so check it out, right? Dudes, this is how it goes. It's spitting out the mouth. You catching it. It's not like a... And you grabbing it. It's coming out. You understand what I'm saying? So anyway, I think this looks a little too bright, white, clear. My eyes look like my eyes. And I don't like that because no disrespect, then dudes be like all crazy, you know, didn't laugh, didn't <laughs> laugh, and commenting, not trying to show off or nothing. So let me darken this situation here. I don't know. I think it looks like, whatever, we're going to get into the story. <laughs> Boom. So, Rikers Island, we in C-74. That's the time that the Asian kids was there with all respects to everybody. Monkey, if I'm not mistaken, Shadow, Boo Black was there. Nate, uh, Super Dave was in the back. Super Dave from uh, Franklin over there by the A train. Is it Spencer? You know, Brooklyn Spencer by Nordstrand and all that? Facts. Super Dave, because that's why I saw him after that when I was going to Nordstrand a lot. So anyway, Super Dave slept all the way in the back. We in C uh, C74. More for lower. It gets crazy, right? One of my boys from Brooklyn is supposed to pop off a situation about his sneakers. I said that story when I got his sneakers back. So I tell Nate, yo, Nate, let me get that gem star, right? And this is where that razor comes into uh, play in the story, right? So I tell him, let me get that gem star, right? This little deadly thing. He's like, wow, I got to take it out, war. I'm like, bro, I really need that. He's like, for who is it? For you? I'm like, nah, it's for my little man. Yo, he better put in that work. I'm like, bro, he's going to do it. He's going to do it. Bottom line is we go to the mess hall, boom, boom. I said the story again, so I don't want to go through all that story again, right? It's the and one of the videos. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna place the video in uh right after this video. At the end of the video, you're gonna see it. The video where I help get the guy his sneakers back, or oh, in the cards, like right up here somewhere, you're gonna see it. Right up here. So anyway, um his situation, Nate's situation, is that he took it out. And now he had to rewrap it because Sunday and Pop. You know what I mean? And no disrespect to him. That's why I never say his name. You know, he was young. He was in the adolescence, whatever, right? But my whole thing is 
I got him the two razors. I gave him mine's poop. And the broski Nate was like, yo, here, on the strength of you, I'm going to give it to him. I'm going to give it to you for, but he better use it, war, because I'm opening it up. It's a lot of work. You feel me? It's like, don't make me pull out the gun and ain't nobody going to blast off. I want to see action. Nate was like that. So anyway, it doesn't happen. Nate wraps it back up. He's tight. You feel me? But I'm like, yo, you good? He's like, shh. The tipo, right? <laughs> like in Spanish, it's like this dude. So he's wrapping it up with him. I don't know. This is like, if you ever have to go through this, which we pray that you don't, right? That you learn enough from idiots like me and other guys that been through this so that you don't make the same mistakes and wind up getting locked up, right? So... He wraps it up and he boop. <laughs> he boops it. Bloop, bloop. And the trunk is gone. Boop, boop. <laughs> right? So he's like, blang. I'm like, yo, you boy. He's like, yeah, so we going to sleep. Now, mind you, we in a mod, like mod four lower. So it's like bed, 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 some type shelter type of living, right? <laughs> Facts. No cell. Shelter, shelter living, bro. Facts. Uh, uh, mod is loose. You smelling feet, <laughs> farts, all types of things, right? Oh, in the nighttime, I hear somebody like, yo, 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 whoa, like, what, B? He's like, yo, I think I gotta go to the infirmary, son. I'm like, well, what the hell? He's like, Bro, I think that razor opened up inside of me. I'm like, nah, bro. Like, I got up like, yo, you serious? He's like, bro, I'm dead serious, bro. I went to the bathroom and I seen a little blood. I guess he tried to like, you know, push and all that. He's like, and it's not there. I was feeling like, I said, bro, you put string? He was like, nah. I said, you lay down, it went up. Bloop. You feel me? Like, what you did? I'm like, bro, you was doing head spins or something. <laughs> but it could happen. You feel me? The plastic, he probably had more before. He probably didn't put a cardboard on the siding. Like, a cardboard that's going to cover this. You know, and if it goes up in your stomach, I don't know how it happened to him, my dude. I never had no, nothing like that. Thank God happened to me. And I boofed on the regular facts. <laughs> I was boofing everything but the tray. Like, boop, that's coming with me. <laughs> like, that's, you got to survive. There's people that'll be like, I'll never boof nothing. Like, that means, like, you go, in a lap, in a lap, in a lap, in a lap. And it's not that type of party. It's just like, you know how to jail it. You know you got bandits. You know it's popping off. You know things are happening. And you got to survive. You know, you gang, gang, gang is either you be ready or you're going to get hit. You're going to get caught slipping. <laughs> you feel me? So I was always one of those dudes. You ever seen the bullpens? You, ever, you always see dude like reaching like. You feel me? Like, and you like, what the hell? I got crabs or something. <laughs> because I was always checking my string facts so i told him bro you gotta put a string you know when you put the plastic and then you leave a little knot on the plastic then you tie a string around that bang and then still in all at the end of the string i make another knot but a big enough knot that i could feel it and pull like blue facts you feel me and i'm a hairy dude anyway not that everybody wants to know that but that is just blending in like bloop. Because you got some COs that used to get so disrespectful that they'd be like squad. He all up. He all up under you like squad again. My dude. If you tell me to squat again, I'm spazzing. I'm not doing that again. Facts. 
Like they be like uh, cough. You be like uh, uh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Do that again. Nah, my dude. We ain't playing games like that. You got one shot, you, uh, and I'm out, bro. I start calling people like, yo, cab, yo, tell this dude like, what's up? This dude wanna keep looking at me like, yo, there's some of them that be like, hold up, squat again, <laughs> cough, spread them, spread them again. Yo, you start feeling <laughs> awkward like my dude, spread them again, and he's like. And, and, and look, with all, <laughs> boop, 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 with all respects to everybody, if he look crazy in the face, you're going to be like, yo, bro, he said, when you, it's like, no, I just didn't hear that. Like, spread him again, spread him again, 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 again. You're like, no. <laughs> At that point, you start feeling violated, man. That's such a violation, B. But at the same token, there was animals <laughs> like us running around. Look at my eyes. <laughs> I'm returning. <laughs> with no disrespect to nobody, trying to have a little humor with it at the same time telling a facts, serious story that goes down. <laughs> Feel me? But somebody has said that before in their video. And it always stuck with a lot of us, you heard? So, fact, shout out to him, bro. That was our song, Campbell. You remember? He was like, yo, bro, look at my eyes, bro. <laughs> oh, he snapped. I F's with him, so I'm not getting at him or nothing. It was, it was funny that time. He knows it was funny. So, anyway, B, you know, um, you got to survive, B. These are things that you got to do. You feel me? I understand, like, the Muslim brothers that I knew, they're like, yo, I don't do that. You know, is it get? I don't know. But, bro, I'm boofing it. One time, I had to, bro, I had a, 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 a copper of things hard, crazy hard, bro. That came with me, too. Boop, I'm taking that. You bugging. I was a bone crusher. Nothing like that, bro. That was crazy games uh, that we used to play, even in the adolescence, bro. And the adolescents playing crazy games. We even with the um 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 with the ID playing with that. Boom, got you. Like yo, stop playing. Now that I think about it, I'm like, bro, we used to play some crazy, super childish games, bro. But anyway, um, that didn't last long because of course I got into a crazy altercation, a crazy fight. Boom, 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 boom. Dudes were like, yo, you could play, but when somebody played with you. That's the way I am. Like, I could joke around, but I'm not with it when the joke is on me, you heard? It's like, we could play baseball, and I'll bat and all that. I'm playing, boop, shh, home run. When it's time to catch, I'll be like, yo, I quit. <laughs> boop. <laughs> yo, so anyway, that opened up inside Nate. I never saw him again. Facts. Hopefully, he's good. But those are things that happen in Rikers Island with these razors. And that's a fact. This is a super deadly little weapon that you need to be careful of and stay away from, bro. When a dude pull out this on you in the street, on an island, whatever. If you ain't about it and you ain't a blocker or you don't got one or you don't really get busy... You need to be careful, especially if you got veins like me that pop off because he could hit you pop in the wrong spot without even meaning to. He could be trying to face tag you, boop, or come womp from behind you, boop, hold that, shh, don't blow it up. <laughs> you know the famous Rikers Island line, boop, shh, don't blow it up, pop, hit, give him a towel and all that facts. But uh, dude could hit you, bang, and you move or something, on a, and hit you in your juggler, and then you gone. <laughs> Leave in the comments if you ever seen that happen, bro. Facts. I'm going to keep it real. Sometimes I don't talk about this because I don't want people to think I'm glorifying or, or, or trying to show off or whatever. But check this out. True story. Facts. Every time I put in a little work, and things had to happen, right? This facts. I had a habit of hitting something, boop, got him, and then blah, 
smacking Thundercats out of here. Whoop. Blah. My man's like, yo, why you hit him? Why? There was no need for that. And I'm like, I always wanted to do that. And once I started doing it, it became habit. You know why? Because I wanted it to open like immediately. I wanted Duke to know you hit. You need to run. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> because a lot of dudes front gang, 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 they tough. And when I used to come and be like, he's talking like in the bullpens, yapping hard. You know, one of them killer gorillas. Ah, he's just talking, but he don't know he's getting me tight. I'm like, boom, he talking, 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 man, shit. He gang, he banging, right? He cell banging. Ah, I'm like, all right. Boop. Guess why he do? Yo, CO! Quick. He, all that tough shit go out the window. Boop. But there was some dudes that you hit him. Boop. And he like want to or be like. So on top of that, it's taking long. He don't know if he's cut yet. Sometimes Duke think that you just punched him. Boop. So I wanted to boop. Blank. <laughs> Yo, look. <laughs> Pew, now run. And that's normally what used to happen, man. Am I uh, 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 happy about the things that took place? No, I'm not, bro. You know, as I think about it, a lot of it was dumb, ignorant. Sometimes I think is that I'm getting soft. But so I'm, I'm really starting to take heed to what Meg used to tell me. Rest in peace. He said, you're not getting soft, war. Because don't get it twisted. You got dudes that will tell you, yo, war official in the street. Huh? You got dudes that be like, oh, I know, sir. Son is a bird. You know what happened with him? Huh? If you was doing street things and street things was happening, you're going to have them stories. You know why? Because those are the haters. He know what it is. He know that I'll take an L to convert into a W. I'm not dumb. Like homeboy, I said in the story that was like, yo, you so-and-so? I was like, yeah. And he pulled out, uh, came out in the car, and then he called like 30 dudes in the train station. I'm not going to be stupid. Like, and I don't even say the whole story. We on the two, Poppy. This is a family-friendly site supposed to be. Nobody's here to glorify or to sell you the uh, a Clean Eastwood movie. That's why all my stories, I say them if you pay good attention with a message. We never glorify, never lying. In fact, we tone our stories down. But yeah, most important things on the island or up north. Bam! <laughs> Café, Bobby. <laughs> or, I'm going to keep it a hundred. Don't let people lie to you, bro. This right here was like the most important thing and it hurt so many people. This hurt so many of our people. Black on black, Latino on Latino, vice versa. It's crazy. I seen a lot of dudes get hurt one time, bro. Hmm. What house was that? I think Mar 1, C-74, bang, right before homeboy tried to escape from my house. Oh, what a dodo brain. He broke out for like three days, was out there, then he broke back in. <laughs> Who you know that? He break back into jail. But that's another video also that is in one of my videos in the bottom. So I'm a, if I remember the title of it, this is a long time ago, I started this channel with Rikers Island Stories, bro. And uh, uh, and it's, I think I told the story too on Golden Culture with a K, like a little bit. But anyway... If I remember, man, early 90s, right? Is it early 90s or 2000? Whatever, bro. I was there so so many times on the island, none of glorified that it feel like <laughs> it feel like some of this stuff happened yesterday, bro. And all along, uh, life and time whew, flew right by me, bro. And now, guess what? I'm like, holy snaps! It's 2020. I'm how old? Like, what the you did with your life, war? Oh, no, you got to hurry up, huh? You got a lot of catching up to do, right? Because at any given time, the bottom line is that we're going to die. So I think about that. But check this out. C-74, Mar 1. I remember this. Um, one of my peoples, right? He was from Salvador. So you know them Salvadorians. If there's always one of them, they get it popping. Like New York style plus with... 
a little bit from their country is a rap for you if he get a knife in his hand. So this dude had a bone crusher, but he was short. But as soon as I went in the house, it was me, Crime, uh, the blood, KO, Lee Moore, that was in the feds. Uh, uh, I think MK came real quick. Like wild MK with the big hair, blood. I think he's Spanish. He's like my complexion. He'd be like, yo, what up, nanny? What up, what up? I think he came real quick to my crib. He he didn't last of anything. Or I, I think, or he came so much to my house to visit. They like he lived here. Facts. But I remember MK coming through too. So anyway, we was down there. Lucky from Tompkins and Brooklyn, a bunch of us, right? This is like Kings and Bloods, like mixed prong when it was, you know, when the uh uh, uh beef had dead it. We all living together is fuego in the houses now, right? Everybody's like on some five R. Uh, it's crazy with the ones that was live wires. You feel me? So, because not everybody's about that. I used to think, like, if somebody didn't get busy like that, like, yo, F him. He's a thug. Like, who bring that dude home? Like, you know, who made him this? Who made him that? But everybody's not for that. Everybody's there for different reasons. You understand what I'm getting at? Like, this dude might be good at computers. This dude might be good at getting jobs. This dude might be a good YouTuber. Like, we need all these morons. They all play a role, right? I know that today I'm getting wise I get. Not soft. It has to do with getting wise, like Meg told me.